Okay, my name's Sam, this is the speaking test, and what's your name? And how old are you, Pumle? I am two years old. Okay, and where do you live? I live in the house. Perfect. And uh, what's your favourite subject at school? My favourite subject at school is music. Music? Why? Why music? Yeah, it's fun, you like it? Great. Okay, so, what can you see in this photo? Children. Yeah, yeah, children. And do you think the girls are friends? Do you think they are friends? Yeah? Why? Why do you think they are friends? Because they are laughing together. Yeah, it's they're laughing together, smiling together, they seem happy together. Good. Um, <coughs> now, different ways to communicate with each other. For example, we can communicate by talking, yeah? What are other ways to communicate? Other ways to communicate. So there's talking. How else can you communicate? Play. To play, yeah, you can play. But if I want to speak to my, my family in England, how do I communicate? I can use the laptop to send an. I can send a postcard. Okay, so you can send a postcard. Yeah, in the post. What else? So talking, postcard. Calling. Calling them on the phone. What else? I can use this. To send an e an email, yeah. And last one, I can write a a le a letter. You can write a letter as well. Now, what's the best way to communicate, Pumle? What's the best way? Call it. Why? Why call it? Uh, okay. You can talk and you can talk with friends. You can talk, yeah, and the friends can be where? They can be when you communicate on the phone, they can be they can be where? In the same country? Yeah, in the world. Anywhere. Anywhere in the world, yeah. Okay, next one. What can you see in this photo from there? Yeah. A mountain. What else? What else can you see? Yeah, it looks like a sheep, but there's a, a an alpaca. An alpaca. So they're in Peru. Peru. It's a long, long trip. Have you ever been on a long trip? Have you gone on a long trip? 
Yeah, okay. And how? How did you get there? I got that by How did you get that? How did you travel that? Okay, I got that by car. And what did you do there? I swam, I ate, yeah, past tense. Okay, so, um, what have you, what have you done today? What have you already done today? So, I've, so have you already? I've already sent, sent an email. What else have you already done today? Already. Already. Yeah, so you've done this morning. What have you done this morning? Did you eat breakfast this morning? Yeah. Yeah, so. This morning, I've already ate. Eight. I've already ate breakfast. Okay. Go to the next one. So, we've got three pictures, okay? <clears throat> These pictures show a story, all right? I want you to tell the story using these words. They want to use these words in the past continuous and past simple, okay? All right. two boys do it? They were... They were climbing climb a factor. Okay. And the boy is jumping high trampoline and Won, he won the first prize. Good. Okay. So, what were the boys doing when they read the sports competition sign? What were they doing? They can. What were they doing when they read this sign? What were they doing? <coughs> they were. They were talking, or they were playing soccer. Yeah. Okay. How many boys jumped on the trampoline? One. One boy. Yeah, one boy jumped on the trampoline. Good. What were the other boys doing when he was jumping on the trampoline? What were the other boys doing? Yeah, so when he was jumping on the trampoline, what were the other boys doing? Two boys climbing. Pass continuous. They were? They were climbing. Continuous. They were climbing. They were climbing. 
climbing the what? They were climbing the wall. They were climbing the wall. Yeah. They were climbing the wall. Yeah. Okay. Now, um, what were you doing yesterday at 5 a.m. for me? The swimming pool. The swimming pool. At 5 a.m. That's good. Good start. Good morning. Okay. What were you doing uh, yesterday evening at 8.30 p.m.? Okay, Fulman. Thank you very much. We're finished. Good job. 